Hey guys, it's your boy Jackie and I'm back with another video and today, if you guys cannot tell from the title of the video, I'm here with what I got for Christmas 2022. So with that being said, key to the intro. You guys are helping me take one step to get to where I want to be and I, it's crazy. I, I love and I appreciate every single one of y'all. So in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys what I got for Christmas 2022. So with that being said, let's get started with today's video. Before we start though, I do want to say this. This video was not made to brag or anything. This video was just made for content. The reason why I'm filming this video is because I know what you got for Christmas videos get views. So I'm just here for the views. But with that being said, that was a joke. I am making this video because I know a lot of people are interested in what I got for Christmas. And I know these videos are popular. Um, but yeah, I'm not trying to brag or nothing. These are just gifts that my parents, cousins, sister, family, um, and friends have gotten me. So with that being said, now let's get started with the video. So to start things off, I have this shoe box. It's not shoes. And I also have this H&M bag right here full of stuff that I got for Christmas. So before we start, fun fact actually, um, this box... I had to use this box as like a box gift wrapping box thing or whatever. I don't know what it's called. So basically the story is I had to put my sister's items in this box, but these are the Trey Young's um, shoe box, but she wasn't getting those because first things first, she works at Nike and if I got her Adidas, she would kill me. And second thing second, um, she doesn't hoop. So why am I going to get her some Trey Young's? Um, but yeah, I just had this box laying out because the Trey Young's are my hooping shoes. And so I had to put her items in this gift. And what I got her was some clothes. I didn't want to go buy some boxes because those are expensive. So I just used what I had and I put my sister's gift in this and when she opened the box i wish i recorded it but she was like what the fuck jackie you know i work for nike i can't be wearing adidas and then i was like but it's not it just open the box um and then yeah she liked the gift um yeah that was just a fun quick little story but if you open the box you can see we got a whole bunch of clothes in here so we just finna pull things out one by one um so to start things off my sister got me some cool nike shorts i don't know how well y'all can see that but you know some we got some cool shorts you know what i mean you know what I'm saying I love my sweat shorts. The one thing that I had to critique about this, and I told my sister, I was like, I'm not gonna lie, these shorts seem a little too high. You know what I mean? I need them hoochie daddy shorts because I'm trying to show off my legs. But yeah, I do love them. These are pretty cool shorts. Um, and I'm gonna make them work. I'm probably gonna have to roll them up. Not gonna lie, I am trying to show my legs. You know what I mean? I am trying to get a leg tattoo too. But yeah, this is one of the items that I got from my sister. So yeah, shout out to my sister because majority of my gifts are from my sister. So shout out to my sister and shout out to my cousins because my sister and my cousins were where my majority of my gifts came from but yeah first item some cool shorts you know what i'm saying it's lit we vibe and we here the next item we have is an essential we have some white nike socks oh i can y'all cannot see them because i don't know the lighting's pretty bad but yeah we got some white nike socks right here um yeah i needed some white nike socks you know what i'm saying these are the essentials i really needed some white nike socks i have a whole bunch of black nike long socks but i didn't have any white ones but now we have additional six pairs so we he lit you know what i'm saying this is the essentials bro because let me tell you something once you guys get older you guys are going to want the essentials you guys are going to want the underwear and the socks because i'm telling you man you can't go around with socks and underwear moving on we got some drip you know what i'm saying we have a lebron james lakers jersey worth his number six you know what i'm saying lebron james we got a lebron james jersey and you know I had to get a LeBron James jersey before he retires because I know when he retires, he's from the, these jerseys for the go cost like a million dollars. But yeah, I can now say I'm a proud owner of a LeBron James jersey. I would definitely say too, I am trying to up my jersey collection because you know what I'm saying? I'm a huge sports fan and I don't have that much jerseys because they are expensive. So shout out to my sister for getting me a LeBron James jersey. My next jersey I really want though, I need to get me a Jeremy Lin jersey. Somehow, somewhere I gotta get me a Jeremy Lin jersey. And then like, you know what I'm saying? I gotta represent because definitely Jeremy Lin was one of my role models growing up, but I am happy to get a LeBron James jersey. So staying on top of the jerseys, we got a John Collins jersey. You know what I'm saying? We got a red John Collins jersey. You know what I'm saying? This is clean. You know, John Collins is probably one of my favorite players on the Hawks. You know what I'm saying? I have a shirt of him ducking on Jordan Embiid in the playoffs. But yeah, now I have a jersey. So yeah, um, I'm a huge ATL fan. Love the Hawks. Love the Falcons. Um, I really wanted a Young Way Koo jersey this year from the Falcons. So the next two jerseys I'm probably going to get is going to be a Jeremy Lin and a Young Way Koo. Um, but yeah, I got me a John Collins jersey. Hopefully we don't trade him because if we trade him, I'm going to be pissed. But, you know what I'm saying, gotta represent the A. ATL, ho. And then the last but not least jersey, 
we have the City Edition Trey Young jersey. You know what I'm saying? Clean Trey Young jersey. The Trey Young jersey I have right now is one of the um, ones that he wore when he was a rookie, those white ones, and it's pretty big. So it was it looked like a dress on me so i'm happy i finally have a new Trey young jersey the city edition because i'm not gonna lie last year i really liked the city edition those yellow jerseys because yellow is my favorite color i really wanted that one but i just didn't have the funds but now i have a new Trey young city edition you know what i'm saying it's put man Trey young please stay in atlanta and bring us home a championship um but yeah we got this Trey young jersey pretty clean pretty clean and yeah also before we move on i do want to say this i am very thankful for everything that i got for christmas and i hope it doesn't seem like i'm not grateful for some of my comments but i'm just i'm very thankful for everything i got because you know in christmas it's all about giving you know what i'm saying so i'm just happy for what i was given moving on we have this clean long sleeve hawk shirt nothing on the back but you know i got the hawks logo but what makes this shirt cool is the the stuff on the sleeves we got a nike logo nba logo hawks logo a basketball peach logo and then a peach tree you know what i'm saying because that trey young jersey that i just showed you that was the peach tree edition you know what i'm saying atl if you cannot tell i'm a huge atlanta fan um but yeah i got another clean long sleeve shirt very clean i like it and yeah we here and this is the next item that i got and this is a t-shirt that i got from my mom and yeah if you guys can't read it I can't either. No, I'm just kidding. So my dad was reading me this, and it basically says, uh, I love Taiwan, because um, my mom is from Taiwan, if you guys didn't know, fun fact. So she got me a Taiwan shirt when she was in Taiwan. Um, I'm not gonna lie, the, the feel of this shirt feels very, very, very good, but the one thing I will say, my mom got me a 2XL if it focuses. And yeah, your boy, I'm losing weight. And like, I don't know, this might look, look pretty big on me. But don't worry, I'm going to make it work. Um, but yeah, I got a I Love Taiwan shirt. Uh, fun fact, i also been to Taiwan when I was younger, when I was in like second grade. But I haven't been back since. And I've never been to Malaysia because my dad is Malaysian. So dad, what you doing? You got to take me back to Malaysia. Um, but yeah, I got a I Love Taiwan shirt. And that is going to conclude the Trae Young box. So now we're going to be moving to the big ass H&M bag. So to start things off, I got this little teddy bear. Um, I got this little teddy bear from my friend, you know what I'm saying? I could add this to my collection. I'm gonna put it right there next to Tanjiro and yeah, my sloth. I gotta readjust this though, but like, yeah, just put him there. Put Tanjiro right there, put the prime bottle here. KSI uh, Logan Paul, if you guys are watching this, you should sponsor me with your prime bottles. Um, but yeah, I got another stuffed animal for my collection. And moving on to what else my friend got me, they got me a property of the Atlanta Falcons. Um, yes, I'm Atlanta Falcons fans. Yes, I know we got limited from the playoffs. Um, yes, I know we're in a whole bunch of rebuild this season. And yes, I know we suck, but I'm gonna ride it down for my team. Because once we win that Super Bowl, or if we ever win that Super Bowl in my lifetime, I'm gonna be like, I was a fan when we were, we were trash. But yeah, I got me this little sign, and then also got me some Falcon stickers. I'm probably gonna put these on my laptop or something because you don't know, gotta represent my team even though you know what I'm saying sometimes we suck and choke um, but I'm still ATL everything you know what I'm saying ATL Falcons the Falcons on my team um, yeah hopefully we can win one day so moving on to the next gift and this has been a tradition in my family between me and my sister for the past like five years she's been doing this since 2017 and what she's been doing has been buying me a calendar every single year from 2017 and this year she changed it up because in the past like four or five years she's bought me Atlanta Falcons ones but now she got me Atlanta Braves ones because you know I guess the Braves are actually good and they won the World Series like two years ago um, but yeah we got Atlanta Braves calendar i hope you guys can tell from the gifts i got i'm a huge sports fan so if you get me anything that's related to atlanta sports i would love it but moving on to something essential that i really really needed and that is this camera bag i really really needed a camera bag because before i didn't have a camera bag and i'll just put my camera in my backpack and just be like fuck it we ball so now i actually have something where i could have a secure safe place to put my camera because like i said i was pretty reckless with my camera and them cameras are expensive so i i'm stupid for just fucking around and throwing my camera anywhere but now I have safety for my camera. Moving on to my last clothing item, I got me this Urban Outfitter um, t-shirt from my cousin. Um, yeah, this looks huge. Um, but yeah, we're gonna make this drip. It's a polo, and I like the I like the color. I thought this was a long sleeve. Dang. Um, but yeah, we're gonna make something work with this, you know what I'm saying? So shout out to my cousin. Moving on to the next gift, I got me some analog Joy-Con sticks for my Nintendo Switch because I will tell you the story now. 
I said this in the video before, but yeah, basically my roommates took over my Switch or my Joy-Con Switch so they could play together on my other roommate's Switch because I have a Switch, my roommate has a Switch. They basically took my Joy-Cons, started playing on the other Switch, got them greasy and dirty and whatever. So now I finally have some new Joy-Con sticks to play on my Switch so I can finally play Pokemon. So huge shout out to my cousin. And moving on, I have this little gift bag from my aunt. So basically she has a whole bunch of little snacks and stuff in this little bag and she also gave me a red envelope or in Chinese we call it a hong bao and basically we got a red envelope and some snacks and basically in red envelopes or hong baos they normally put money in them and she gave me some money and some snacks so I'm thankful for that so shout out to my aunt and also with that being said my dad also gave me a red envelope or hong bao with a hundred dollars so shout out to my dad um, well I guess it was for my dad and my mom so my parents um, so yeah shout out to my parents moving on to another gift that I got from my other aunt and yeah, it is a Michael Kors wallet. And fun fact, I actually been looking for a new wallet because my wallet is like, it matches my wallet. And she didn't even know that, but like it matches my wallet. Um, my wallet has been like acting up because it was like a little like tear like at the bottom ish, like right there. I don't know if y'all can see. So I really didn't need a new wallet. But the thing with this wallet is that this wallet, like look at the size comparison. Like this wallet is fucking huge. Um, but yeah, I like my wallet small and thin. So I could so like fit my jeans and stuff like that. But I might have to start rocking this because, I mean, it is clean. You know what I'm saying? Michael Kors, baby. You know what I'm saying? If you know anything about Asians, we love our name brand stuff, especially Michael Kors. And then the last gift I got, it is a roller. Bruh, I'm old, but my back hurts, my neck hurts, my knees, my body. My body hurts. So I definitely needed a roller so I could, like, just roll out my stuff. I think next year also, I'm going to ask for one of them, like, machine things that like you massage your body i definitely need one of those i should have asked for that this year but i just it, i didn't think about it until i got the roller but yeah shout out to my cousin who got me a roller so now i can finally fix my back and that is going to conclude my gifts just kidding i have one more gift let me go get it so my last and final gift i got me a new car let me show you a quick video of it you know you see the vibes new car it's kind of dark where i'm at but yeah my new car is a dodge challenger you know what I'm saying? I gotta get the windows tinted a little bit. Um, yeah, it's really dark right now. Y'all can't really see the car. Um, but yeah, this is the new car. Yo, it looks mean as fuck. Yo. And yeah, y'all just got pranked. I didn't get a new car for Christmas. I wish I got a new car, but um, yeah, that's basically my rental car that I'm trying to act like it's my car. But yeah, no, my car's in the shop. Yeah, if you guys didn't know, I got hit from the back about like two months ago. So my car's in the shop and I'm just waiting for it to get done. So I just thought it'd be funny if I'd be like, oh, I got a new car for Christmas. Um, that's, that's my rental car for now. And I'm just waiting for my car to get back. So prank deal. But with that being said, that is going to conclude today's video. And comment down below what you guys got for Christmas because I'm very interested. I really do like watching these videos because it's very intriguing and just interesting to see what people got for Christmas, see how people are different from others, compare gifts and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, with that being said, I am very thankful for everything I got for Christmas this year. And I hope everyone who I gave gifts to love their gifts. And yeah, with that being said, I ain't got nothing else left to say. Um, but yeah, wait, I lied. I definitely lied. I do have some last words for me. Um, this is definitely going to be my last Christmas video of the year. And this is most likely going to be my last video for 2022. So with that being said, it's not goodbye because you guys will be seeing me in 2023. And like I said in the last video, 2023 is going to be my year and I'm going to make it my year. And we just want to keep grinding and you guys want to get better content from your board. And yeah, with that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Subscribe, share, and your boys out.